Professor Yuku. At this time, I'd like to honor the master, the grandmaster that I saw as a child that made me want to play this music. It was Duke Ellington. And my parents took me to see Duke Ellington when I was a little boy. Just started the trombone, 10 years old. And uh, oh, it was great. Man, they had Ella Fitzgerald singing. They had um, Coleman Hawkins was the guest soloist. And Johnny Hodges, Clark Terry was in the band. I was a kid. I did not know what they were doing, but it was magic. And I said, wow, man, I want to do that. And so I'm still doing it, you know. That got me started, and let's say I got the, got the bug, you know. I got the hitch to follow through and learn how to play. So this is something I composed, and it's going to feature our wonderful pianist, Rick Germanson. It's called Dinner with Duke.
This next composition has got a, a message. Um, I grew up in the San Francisco Bay Area, and I really got involved in the music and in life during the 1960s. And there was a lot going on in the Bay Area in California during the 60s in the San Francisco area. We had, um, well, the hippies were there. Well, the white kids had the hippies, you know, Haight Ashbury and all that. And then the Latinos, we had Viva la Raza and Cesar Chavez. And he had a movement to get the farm workers decent wages so they could eat and not be in debt to the landowners. And then we had the Black Panthers, and they were tired of the police brutality in Oakland. And so, really what everybody wanted was peace. That's all everybody really wanted. So I wrote this composition for peace, and I call it Flower Power. <laughs>
heard of a drummer, a great drummer, by the name of Winard Harper. He, he had a group called the Harper Brothers back in the 90s. But they came over here a lot. Well, Deshaun is his uncle. It's a family thing. Yeah, you're his nephew. He's your uncle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, we also have another family connection with my son on the drums. <laughs> we're going to feature him on this next composition. And I wrote this. Well, there's a, there's a song that the, the, the musicians in New York like to play at a jam session to see. But it's fun to play if you know how to play changes, which is harmony, if you know your harmony. So uh, the tune is called Cherokee. I know most of you have heard of Cherokee. But I got tired of that melody, man. It's like, boom, 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 boom. You know, it's just like that. Was, no, the, the melody wasn't too interesting. To so I wrote a new <laughs> melody based on that harmony. And that way I get the royalty. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, um, Cherokee, as you know, was a Native American tribe. So I called this one after a different Native American uh. tribe. This is called Blackfoot. He said that with the drum. Blackfoot. Play me some Blackfoot. 